Go. Hi, I'm Kate Snow. I'm the author of Preschool Math at Home, 35 Activities that Lay the Foundation for Math Success. I'm here with my daughter today to show you the number race game, which comes from Chapter 4 of Preschool Math at Home. Uh, in this chapter, kids are working on connecting the written numerals to the spoken numbers that they're already familiar with. To play this game, you'll need a number race board. There's a printable in my book, but you can make this easily at home, too. All you need to do is draw a grid of 10 squares and label them from number 1 through number 10. You'll also need two game pieces. These are just from Candyland, and you'll need just a coin with the heads and the tails. You ready to play number race? Great. So to start number race, you put your pieces on the number 1. Are you going to be green? Yellow. You're going to be blue. Okay. So let's put them on number 1. And to play, all you do is flip the coin. If you get heads, you move forward one space. If you get tails, you move forward two spaces. Can you flip the coin and go first? Yep. Okay. Ooh, tails, two spaces. So what do we say? One, two. Well, one, two, three. three. So you say the space you're on plus the spaces you're moving to. That's the key part of this game. So then it's my turn. Let's see what I get. I, oh, I, I, I know, but I got head, so I say one, two. Your turn. Start with heads. Go ahead. Oh, you got a head, so what do you say? Three, four. Good job. And so you keep on playing until one of you gets all the way to ten. Uh, this game is so simple, um, but kids really like it. It goes fast, and it's easy to play a few times in a row. Uh, the benefits of it are amazing. Uh, this is actually a game that scientists have tried out with preschoolers, and they found that the effects are so powerful that they uh, last for months, even without any review. And they benefit kids in four different ways. Um, first of all, they're reviewing the counting sequence, of course, as they count out the different numbers. But as they say it, they're also looking at the written numerals and figuring out how the written numerals connect to the words. They also are developing an understanding of number lines about how you can go, uh, how numbers increase, and they're trying to get a sense of which numbers are greater than other numbers and which numbers are less. So a very lot of good math happening in one simple game. If you'd like to see more games like this, you can check out Preschool Math at Home: 35 Activities That Lay the Foundation for Math Success.